All About Evil, 2010. Written and directed by Peaches Christ. Starring Natasha Lyonne, Thomas Decker, and Jack Donner. To keep her father's movie theater in business after inheriting it, a timid librarian successfully launches a career making short slasher movies that are actually real. This film was recommended by a fan. Thanks for the suggestion. I had two lingering concerns going into this film. A lot of sites are incorrectly summarizing this film. The librarian isn't screening these films as snuff films. She is killing people in the movie, but she presents them as tongue-in-cheek slasher movie shorts with titles like The Scarlet Leper and The Maiming of the Shrew. I was also worried that the characters were going to be grating and obnoxious, thanks to the success of Rob Zombie's trashy exploitation films negatively influencing the horror landscape in the 2000s and 2010s. The characters are sinister and charming instead. No one is there to get on your nerves. Once I realized that the film wasn't going to have the extremism of one or the obnoxiousness of the other, however, I got comfortable, and ended up enjoying this film immensely in the process. The film set out to entertain, and entertained I was. This was actually Christ's feature film debut as writer and director, which doesn't come across that way. The film is well made, it seems like something the cast and crew had a lot of fun working on. Natasha Lyonne really chews the scenery as the librarian-turned-murderous filmmaker, carrying the film in the role of a lifetime. She doesn't work alone, either. As the film progresses, she recruits other fiendish people to act as her film crew and theater staff, almost becoming a demented family along the way. This film reminds me of later John Waters films. Cecil B. Demented came to mind in particular. Mink Stoll, a frequent collaborator with Waters, even appears in the film. Aside from Leon and Stoll, there are a couple of other familiar faces as well. Thomas Decker, who played John Connor in Terminator The Sarah Connor Chronicles, plays a high school student dealing with the all-too-relatable negative misconceptions horror fans get from society. And Elvira herself, Cassandra Peterson, plays his concerned and protective mother. The makeup effects are understandably modest, but there's a particularly memorable kill involving a guillotine, though not used in the way that you'd expect. Verdict? Highly recommended. A love letter to cult films and slasher movies with a lot of heart. And other organs. That concludes this week's review. If there's any obscure sci-fi or horror film you'd like to suggest, feel free to leave a comment below. Make sure to tune in next time for another thrilling, low-budget adventure.